In this video, you will learn how to create stroke stop motion animation such as this one on my canvas. All you need is pen tool for creating this animation and of course a video on the background to follow the frames and create the shapes. Just dragging the video from my desktop to my canvas and waiting for the upload to finish. After the upload is done, just resetting the video and creating an artboard in order to create animation. As you know, videos should be inside an artboard to preview or create keyframes. Let's make this artboard size same with the video size. Selecting the artboard and clicking on the fit content icon here. Now we are all set to start creating shapes. Starting to create my silhouette shapes according to the video. Grabbing my pen tool and following the running guy on my canvas. Drawing according to the body movement. Let's make my stroke green and bigger to show it much clearer. Now I am done with the first drawing. Press escape key to finish your shape. Just open the layers panel and be sure that this shape included in the same artboard with the video because now I will enable the animation mode and create all keyframes. I will enable the animation mode and add keyframes to this shape to bring into the timeline editor. Because timeline only shows the layers with keyframes. So, I will work with opacity for this shape and creating an opacity keyframe first. And the moment I click on the keyframe icon on opacity input, as you see, it is just added to timeline editor. Now adding another keyframe for opacity to create the animation. Adding zero opacity to the second keyframe to create this fading out effect. Now the stroke on the shape slowly fading out in almost half a second, maybe shorter. Let's make the second keyframe. While this first shape fading out, I will create the second shape and apply the same keyframes. Grabbing the pen tool and starting to draw again. Now I am done with the second shape and I can create keyframes for it. Again, I enable the motion recording mode after selecting the shape, adding my opacity keyframe. Moving the playhead and creating my second keyframe which makes the opacity zero. Very quickly I have created this animation with only two shapes. You can adjust the timing always from the timeline editor. Make it faster or slower. You can create more shapes to make your animation smoother like the one here. This project includes around 20 shapes to get this result. There is no easy way for this. You need to create shapes frame by frame according to your project. More shapes will give more continuous results. Less shapes will give you like a stop motion video effect. And of course, you can change the stroke or path anytime you want. Basically, if you don't enable the recording animation mode, all your changes will affect the appearance, not the motion. That's it, you simply put a video on the background, draw shapes frame by frame and get this amazing effect on your videos. You can now go and create your own shape animation like this one. Simply follow the link and register for the beta version now. In one hour you will receive the invitation.